What's going on, my dudes? Mr. Sam, man, and Sonny back in this shit. Yo, I'm not gonna lie. I was thinking about when I was watching SmackDown today of the Cruiserweight division. I remember when SmackDown had a um, Cruiserweight division, not Raw, but SmackDown. And that's what set SmackDown apart from Raw. They had the um, Cruiserweight division that had the fast paced action, high flying, you know, exciting type of action. And I don't know, for some reason they just stopped it many years back. I don't know why they stopped it for, because it was really um, setting SmackDown apart from Raw. You had um, Spike Dudley, Paul London, you had um, Brian Kendrick, oh, excuse me, excuse me, the Brian Kendrick, you know, you had Billy Kidman, amongst others. And they was doing the goddamn thing, you know. They was um, good openers. Like, you know, the Cruiserweight match was a good opener for a card, whether it be a TV show or a pay-per-view. That's what gets people amped for the rest of the show. Now we don't have that anymore. And a um, couple of um, Cruiserweights suffered because of that. You have your, you know, Evan Bournes and, you know, your um, sometimes Kofi Kingston's, you know, they'll suffer because there's no cruiserweight division. And so they'll have to be forced into a tag team. It's really sad because um, the, cruiserweight, the cruiserweight division actually was, you know, they had, they had their own style. That other than the middleweights and the heavyweights, cruiserweights they had their own style. It was more exciting, you know. It gets people amped for the rest of the card. And like, what, 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 what else would you want other than that? Like, you want to start your night off with some high flying action at first. Come on, even Eddie Guerrero was in the cruiserweight division. He went from the cruiserweight division and built himself up to be a heavyweight champion. Like, you would, WWE and WCW was creating stars th through the cruiserweight division also. Look at D. Malenko. Like, come on. What the fuck? Look at motherfucking, um, what the fuck this dude's name is? S.A. Reels. Whatever the, what, what, what happened to him? You know what I'm saying? Like, like, it was so much lightweight motherfuckers that was putting in work. And now it's like, the only thing that WWE is focused on is the World Heavyweight title and the Heavyweight title. You know, no, WWE title, excuse me. And it's fucking bullshit because you got these motherfuckers invincible right now. So it's like, who gives a fuck about those titles too? You got Sheamus, he fights the same person every single fucking week. And what does he do? Catches this dude Dolph Ziggler with a bro kick to win the match. Or um, this dude, um, Zach, no, excuse me, this dude Alberto Del Rio. Catches him with a bro kick and that's the end. This dude fucking um, CM Punk, that's my dude and all. But y'all doing the same thing with him. Nah, he's unbeatable. It's like, come on, B. Like, this shit is ridiculous, B. Like, cruiserweights, it was anything, it was like anything can happen. You know, like, you have various matches. I remember when this dude, Spike Dudley, was the um, cruiserweight champion, and he was the boss of the Dudley boys. That was some creative shit. You know what I mean? Like, who would have ever thought that he would have been the boss of the Dudley Boys? You feel me? Oh, man. Who else? I think even Scotty Too Hotty, shit. Even he was a Cruiserweight champion. He was dancing around and all that stuff. He was entertaining for the Cruiserweight belt. It was a couple of people that was entertaining, you know what I mean, for the Cruiserweight title. I don't understand why they just don't want to bring that division back. Like, bring, bring some of that high fire stuff back. You know, like, it's not too much high fires around right now. 
And come to think of it, y'all dudes just saw this dude, um, Pac. You know, he's a lightweight, he's a cruiserweight wrestler. What are y'all gonna do with him? You know, like, like, like with Senkata. What are y'all gonna do with him? These are lightweight wrestlers, cruiserweight, whatever. What are y'all gonna do with them? You know, uh, like you, you just have the best, um, um, fucking high flying sensations. You know, just to win a couple of matches here and there, just to get a couple of quick bucks, and that's it. They'll keep them around for longevity. Especially with Pac. Like, I hope they don't do that shit with Pac. Because Pac is a fucking beast when it comes to aerial moves. They definitely need to bring back the cruiserweight belt for Pac. If not that, then who else? Sandman is signing off for right now, B. Bring back the cruiserweight division. Peace out, motherfuckers.